What's up, guys? So, welcome back. How you that day now? Uh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from. I hope you guys are very much doing okay. So, we're going to start this video discussing about David Do. The issue is having with one of those uh, female artists he decided to collaborate with on his uh, timeless album, and the song name is Kanti. Honestly, that's one of my favorite songs in that timeless album. Fabs did her thing, but unfortunately, she's mistalking. She's mistalking, I swear. And I bet you she will even regret it now. Well, I don't know what happened between David Doe and this girl. David Doe has supported this girl a lot. David Doe, for while she while he performed at O2, David Doe brought out this girl. So many other places he performed, David Doe brought out this girl. But guess what? It seems like something, something happened. This girl wrote, she said, Begun my, began my new year with such a huge gag, LOL, hugging. David Doe backstage as he is about to perform. To watching him perform Kante in a new version with my verse taking off. Performing with you would have been a good way to start my year. But I guess life happened. Happy New Year. Well, apparently there's a new version of that uh, song, Kante. Kante, a new version, that and a verse wasn't in that song. And she's not happy that she hugged David Doe backstage. And David Doe went on stage to perform that song. And meanwhile, her verse was removed. I do not know the relationship between David Doe and Fabs. I don't know how it is with these celebrities. Is it okay to remove someone's verse without letting your whole song go? Is it okay to remove another person's verse from your song without letting that person know? Is that a cool stuff to do? Is that right to do? Because I don't want to start blaming David or blaming this girl. Because ordinarily, you know, they carry, don't carry things to social media. Once you carry it to social media, people are going to read meaning into it. And once they start reading meaning into it, did David do see this message now? Ego verse. Ego verse. Now, look at what she wrote. She said, I guess I should have just texted David Doe how I felt instead of tweeting it. I forget how the internet can be sometimes. Someone said, delete that tweet and apologize to David Doe and all 30 BG. That's all. <laughs> now you call out David Doe. You say you forget how internet be. There are some people you can't call out. I've, I've said before, there are some celebrities who can get free pass to curse anybody. And guess that celebrity who has one, who one celebrity in Nigeria who can insult anybody and get away with it. Guess the person? Portable. Now only portable, if you comfortably call out the video and people will still forgive her. People will move on. Just indirectly call whiskey, call a bona boy. People will move on because they know not saying him. Now like I say him be. But can't he? You know even in saw the video. But the way you take tweet that tweet, it be like say you say the video cheat you. The video never treated you well. That is how people read me to that tweet. That's how I'm going to read me to it because that's how I would that is what I see. You for no tweet that kind of tweet. Oh. You say David don't hug you for a bad stage. Go on stage, go perform. You know, come bring you on stage to perform. Uh uh. No being they perform. Now by force say you and I do something together, you must come perform alongside me. Now now you don't tweet yeah 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 thing now. You are trying to do damage control by apologizing. Ah uh uh. You don't do well now. You don't do well now. 
Now check out this video. The moment camera zoomed in on James Brown while uh, Pastor Ibuka Kubi was about to pray for all the people with unbinding spirit. Lift your hand up. All the people with a, a bunch spirit here, you are set free today. Amen. Who? What is the issue? A prayer ground for everybody. Yes, sir. James Brown, can you say a girl of blind spirit? Yeah. Well, now the live person, person decide to come church, come uh, worship God. And when I, the, the, the man was talking about a blind spirit. Yeah. Pray for people with a blind spirit and the camera don't to just brown face. Just brown tell you say girl blind spirit. Hmm? I tell you. Don't you know someone having a blind spirit? That that is by be an excuse. <laughs> Even uh, Destiny Tico did there as well. Uh -uh. That cameraman, uh, there's a post meet and made a give a slap. That is an insult. So you automatically missing just brand get or by the spirit. That's why you just show your face, bam. Okay, I pray make uh, if uh, just brand get or by the spirit, or how you guys can identify or by the spirit. Eh? Make your bad spirit come up for me, buddy. Now, let's see. Yeah, let's see if indeed just brand get your bad spirit. You know, maybe just brand man eh? or lie. I'll go find that cameraman a tear and better slap. Check out this uh, news. Uh, they said America model Bella Handy. Rejected a marriage proposal for one of the richest Qatari prince. Bella said to Prince, Donate half of your wealth to Palestine, and then I will be ready to give you my attention, according to me. Bella Handy is originally from Palestine. His father is a wealthy real estate person. In America, approximately even close to one billion, more than a billion dollars. Huh? Go and check their families. Their, their father is quite rich, and they are now Americans. So check out this now. You know exactly what is happening between Israel and Palestine, with, with whatever is happening there. Bella has been advocating for Palestine, and the Qatari prince, a billionaire, is asking for a hand in marriage and guess what she said she said if you want me to marry you hmm, you need half of your wealth to the palestine ah if that you you wish to be the billionaire man you will donate <laughs> voilà. if you be the billionaire man because say you see super model model make you get tiny waist and long legs very fine face you see me, you go donate all your wealth for Palestine. You go donate. You go donate. Well, that was her request too. She said, if that man fulfill it, she will start giving that man her attention. Meanwhile, there are a lot of young guys out there who just knock your bonani for free. Increase. But it's good to donate your wealth to, to the poor, though. That's a really, really nice stuff. But a request is just to ask. <laughs> I 
Our request is just to what? Ash. Request is just to ash. Just to ash. If you donate the money, how are you sure you get to the people who actually need it? How are you sure? You might not get to them. 